Time now for an update from Fox Carolina News and Fox Carolina Weather. Weather rate certified most accurate. A good Tuesday afternoon. I'm Cody Alcorn. We are following several developing stories, including breaking news out of Western North Carolina. We do know there has been a house explosion uh, near Forest City, just outside the Rutherfordton. Uh, it's on Davis Lake Road. Uh, we are working to confirm uh, the extent of injuries here. We do know a medical chopper was requested uh, to that scene. Uh, it's still a large scene out there. We have a crew uh, there along Davis Lake Road. We'll have updates this afternoon at four, five, and and six and of course tonight at 10 and 11. We're also following breaking news out of Virginia where there has been a report of a shooting at Bridgewater College. Now ABC News is reporting a officer has been shot. The college did tweet out there is a person in custody. Uh, we are following that very closely as well. And we'll have updates inside our free Fox Carolina News app and, of course, uh, at foxcarolina.com. We do want to check in with Chief Meteorologist Kendra Kent, though. Not a bad afternoon out there, Kendra. It's uh, considered mild, really, for January. Yeah, <laughs> and with all that sunshine you get in your car, it's nice and warm. Yeah. And, uh, yeah, things are looking good. But say goodbye to the sunshine tomorrow. The clouds will be rolling in, and then we'll have a chance of some rain by Wednesday night into the day Thursday. But tonight, no rain expected, just some clouds and still pretty chilly. 34 for the upstate in the mountains, low 30s expected clouds will be on the move and then we'll be watching for increasing rain into late Wednesday. Notice Wednesday 11 a.m. Just seeing a few spots of drizzle and cloud cover, but here comes the real rain. It's going to be light at first on, as we go into Wednesday night into Thursday, but we'll continue with waves of rain with the heaviest expected into the overnight Thursday night, but then it looks like we're going to clear up nicely as we go into Friday. Of course, you can check in on the four and five o'clock newscast and six as well tonight and the 10 and 11 o'clock news. And don't forget to download the Fox Carolina app as well as check us out on Facebook and our YouTube channel.